you gonna call? Ghostbusters! If there's something weird and it don't look good, who you gonna call? Ghostbusters! All right. I'm gonna turn over the next card. I want you to concentrate. I want you to tell me what you think it is. Square. Good guess, but wrong. <laughs> Clear your head. All right? Tell me what you think it is. Is it a star? It is a star. <laughs> Very good. That's great. Okay. All right. Think hard. What is it? Circle. Close. But definitely wrong. <laughs> OK. All right. Ready? Yeah. All right. What is it? Figure eight. Incredible. That's five for five. You can't see these, can no, you? No, no. You're not cheating me, are you? No, I swear. They're just coming to me. <laughs> OK. Nervous? Yes. I don't like this. You only have 75 more to go, OK? What's this one? Couple wavy lines. Sorry, this isn't your lucky day. I know. Uh, um. Well, yeah, um. I, 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 I'm getting a little tired of this. You volunteered, didn't you? We're paying you, aren't we? Yeah, but I didn't know you were going to be giving me electric shocks. What are you trying to prove here, anyway? I'm studying the effect of negative reinforcement on ESP ability. The effect? I'll tell you what the effect is. It's pissing me off. Well, then maybe my theory is correct. You can keep the five bucks I've had. I will, mister. You may as well get used to that. It's the kind of resentment that your ability is going to provoke in some people. Do you think I have it, Dr. Venkman? You're no fluke, Jennifer. This is it. This is definitely it. See, those UV lenses come in for the video camera and that blank tape. I need it, the one you erased yesterday. Will you excuse me for a second? I'm right in the middle of something, Ray. Uh, I need a little more time with this subject. Could you come back in an hour, hour and a half? Peter, at 1.40 p.m. at the main branch of the New York Public Library on Fifth Avenue, 10 people witnessed a free-floating, full-torso vaporous apparition. It blew books off shelves from 20 feet away and scared the socks off some poor librarian. I'm very excited. I'm very pleased. I want you to get right down there, check it out, and get back to me. No, okay? no, get right back no, to me. No, Peter, you're coming with us on this one. Spengler went down there. He took PKE valences, went right off the top of the scale, buried the needle. We're close on this one. I can feel it. I can feel it. We're very, very close. I have to go now, Jennifer. But I'd like to work with you some more. Perhaps you could come back this evening, say at... 8 o'clock? I was just going to say, 8 o'clock? <laughs> you are a legitimate phenomenon. As a friend, I have to tell you, you're finally going around the bend on this ghost business. You guys have been running your ass off, meeting and greeting every schizo in the five bros who says he has a paranormal experience. What have you seen? Of course you forget, Peter. I was present at an undersea, unexplained mass sponge migration. Oh, Ray, the sponge is migrating about a foot and a half. <laughs> Oh, you're here. Yeah, yeah, what have you got? This is big, Peter. This is very big. There's definitely something here. Egon, this reminds me of the time you tried to drill a hole through your head. You remember that? That would have worked if you hadn't stopped well, me. I'm Roger Delacroix. Are you the man from the university? Yes, I'm Dr. Finkman, Dr. Stance, Egon. 
Thank you for coming. Hope we can clear this up quickly and quietly. Let's not rush things. We don't even know what you have yet. I don't remember seeing any legs, but it definitely had arms because it reached out for me. Arms? I can't wait to get a look at this thing. Alice, I'm going to ask you a couple of standard questions, OK? Have you or any member of your family ever been diagnosed schizophrenic, mentally incompetent? My uncle thought he was St. Jerome. I'd call that a big yes. Uh, are you habitually using drugs, stimulants, alcohol? No. No, no, just asking. Are you, Alice, menstruating right now? What has that got to do with it? Back off, man. I'm a scientist. Ray, it's moving. Come on. Hot, Ray. Symmetrical book stacking, just like the Philadelphia Man's Turbulence of 1947. You're right. No human being would stack books like this. Listen. You smell something? Talk about telekinetic activity. Look at this mess. Raymond, look at this. Ectoplasmic residue. Bankman, get a sample of this. It's the real thing. When somebody blows their nose and you want to keep it. I'd like to analyze it. There's more over here. I'm getting stronger readings here. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Ah. This way. Come on. Oh. Egon, your mucus. <laughs> 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 